to see both of you guys. I just wanted to say I'm going to claim that uh, 100K in USDM in Dubai this year. It's going to get competitive, huh? Yeah, it is. You, know, oh, you yeah. got me excited. We, we solved the attendance problem for the summit. Yeah, <laughs> they're coming. <laughs> so what you been working on these days? So last year, you know, I sat down next to both of you guys and I said, you know, we're going to build two smart contracts over the next year. We're going to build staking baskets that allows you to delegate to over 100 different stake pools at the same time and earn additional Cardano native tokens for supporting decentralization and all those small businesses and a smart contract that allows you to mint profile NFTs, which you can level them up from using Cardano, Twitter and Discord and following your favorite projects, engaging with the community. And, you know, when I was mentioning all of this, it, it seems so far in the future. But now all of it's live on testnet it's live on testnet yep. you write in aiken yep so the uh, profile nft smart contracts in aiken and then the staking basket smart contract is in plutarch Ooh, mm -hmm. that's exciting so what were some of the challenges you encountered in building it um, with Icon, it was quite easy to integrate it. I would say it took us about three days to integrate it, whereas once we actually had the smart contract with uh, Plutarch, it took us a few months, quite honestly. And I think the biggest challenge was uh, learning UTXO and, and understanding, you know, you have to grab the reference, you know, from the smart contract when you're building the transaction. And, you know, it, it took us a couple of months or a few months, but once we had that down, I felt like we had a, a much better understanding Understanding of UTXO as a team and, uh, you know, definitely have a lot more momentum from that early experience. Well, that's exciting. So where'd you get your developers from? So I always ask every project, did you write the code yourself? Did you recruit people? How did that work? So it's a mix of both. You know, um, I would say more than half of my developers are from my YouTube channel. You know, they, I've made YouTube videos for years and, you know, developers will reach out to me and say they're fans and I'll say, well, what languages do you write in? You know, maybe you can join the team. And, you know, I would say we've got about 60% from there. Uh, we've also worked with M Labs in the past for staking baskets. And uh, we worked with uh, somebody named Walge online who's, who's very great with Icon, And uh, we still work with them to this day. So um, everything like the, the front end, the design is all in house, but for the smart contracts, we've, we've worked with uh, other teams as well. And how do you think about product development? I always ask anybody who's a CEO or founder who's in involved heavily in Web3 stuff, how do you get a product backlog? How do you get that right product market fit? So like, why this over something else? What, what, what was something that really got you excited about it? Um, I've wanted to see multi-delegation for years. So with staking baskets, I'll start with that one. And you also talked about this idea years ago of stake pool operators kind of coming together and working together. A good marketer is going to be on this side. You know, a good, uh, you know, sysadmin and, uh, you know, a good business guy. They all can come together, use a staking basket, start one, and then on chain, all of the revenue can be split evenly or, in what, or the stake can be split evenly among their pools based on the value that they provide. You know, that definitely got me really excited. Um, you know, just to kind of announce a new feature, you know, there's a parameter on Cardano called A0. In A0, if you stake 72 million ADA to a pool, you can earn 30% more staking rewards than a normal delegate to a pool. So using the staking basket smart contract, we have found a way to bring that 30% up to 30% to users of Staking Basket smart contracts. So we've actually built pledge into the Staking Basket smart contract to where, you know, let's say there's already 32 million ADA in there, you're going to be earning 15% more ADA than everyone else, and you only have to have 10 ADA to deposit. That's so, pretty crazy, isn't it, Tim? Pretty good. Yeah, I mean, originally the staking basket thing was also about de getting stake more widely delegated yes. as well, and that's obviously a very powerful feature too. It is, yes. That, that was our first feature. So we're launching Diffusion. That's going to be the first staking basket. This is something new that's probably more like six months out. So the first basket's called Diffusion, and this is run by the Atrium DAO. It's going to be governed by ADA holders and then Atrium DAO token holders once that launches. But the first 50 pools are going to be put in there from all ADA holders voting on our site. And then that's going to delegate to 50 different single stake pool operators. It's going to be broken up into three tiers. There's going to be smaller operators, say, in the 300,000 to 1.5 million range, and then a tier above that, and then a tier to kind of average out the rewards, but also support decentralization at the same time. So to kind of like, you know, what led me to the profile NFT smart contract? So I've always been really excited about decentralized identity, right? Well, I thought, you know, I don't have the ability to, you know, work with nation states or work with governments to bring dids to everyday people. But yeah, don't do that. It's a losing yeah, proposition. Yeah, I, I, if you, yeah, exactly. If you can't do it, I'm not pulling it off, right? <laughs> so 
you know, I thought, well, what do we, what do we need now, right? I could essentially build a smart contract that mints decentralized identities for people, but they're not DIDs, they're profile NFTs. So essentially, it's a Web3 profile that you know you can level up and customize from using Twitter and Discord, and eventually it's gonna be a profile page that lives in Atrium that other people can follow. You can aggregate your Medium, your Twitter. If you're a stake pool operator, you can have your users stake to you or see pool notifications you know, directly in there. So you know, we also launched um, the education dashboard too. 24 educational videos, all motion graphic with text guides that guide you through your Cardano experience. So as you're using Atrium, you're seeing these videos and you know, what is staking? What is an NFT? What is a, you know, a DEX or a DEX aggregator? All of this lives directly in that platform. And uh, you know, both smart contracts, the education portal and the dashboard, all live right now. Hey, always good to see you. Thank you very much for joining us. Do you want a quick shout out? Where can people find out more? Um, Atrium.io on Twitter, um, Atrium underscore lab. My personal account is uh, BigPayYT on Twitter, and it's always a pleasure. I really appreciate Fantastic. you guys inviting yeah. me. Thank you, and this is a live view of the Cardano network behind us, and that's this is just so magical. I love it, EU TXO. But just this fact that while we're having a conversation, people are actually using Cardano, doing things. And yeah. you're one of the builders, man. Thank you so much. Thank you, guys. And, Wouldn't uh, be here without you. Yep. We'll see you around, okay? Cheers. Fantastic. Thank you very much, Pay from Atrium.